Okay, so we have the bees have swarmed. This is uh, May 14th, 2010. They were kind of out on the they were kind of out on the front of the hive, which is about 30 feet away that way, and uh, last couple days. So kind of thought they might swarm, and sure enough, here they are, the old queen. Uh, Decided it was too crowded in there, and uh, there was a lot of bees this year. And it looks like it took about 20,000 sisters with her. Uh, the last time that they swarmed, a totally different queen came to this same tree. Uh, peace tree in the orchard here. So I'd actually uh, anticipated this and uh, already had the, this new uh, I've uh, set up over here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring the that box under here, so I don't have to cut any of this tree off. Uh, and I'm just going to put it straight under here, shake them down in there, uh, and just kind of leave it there and hope that they'll take. Yeah. As you can see, they're pretty, pretty docile. Uh, when they're in swarm mode, they're they're just uh, interested in. And, uh, oh, oh, thing's empty. It's still heavy. When they swarm, they're just interested in. You know, getting the queen to a new spot. And that's all they need. All they want. So I'm going to. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly run in here and get an empty super. So we will kind of dump in here in the top. Uh, and then I'll. Uh, I wish they were more bunched up because uh, I'm guessing the queen is in this part where there's more of them. But uh, there's a bunch up here too, so gotta be careful and try to get all the whole bunch in there so you get the all queen right. in there with them. Otherwise, they'll just come straight back out. About 30 seconds later, and I've got that in there. I think I'll put the board under the back of this just to make it. matter as much at this point. If they take to this and settle in, I'll just move it back over to where this was. Now. Okay. So, I'm all suited up more than I usually would, not because I'm afraid of them. I just got stung a couple days ago and my knees aren't very up and I don't feel like getting stung again. Probably will anyway, but whatever. So, now I'm just going to shake them out of here. Pick up all these guys. Now yeah, they're a little pissed off. So... Settle down. One just stung me through this glove. Hmm. I think she may be still be on there, so I'm gonna knock this off. Okay, so I just did some running, and <laughs> usually they'd stay on you a little more, but they're more interested in coming back to the queen. Uh, so it's really hard to say 
we got to wait and see where she is. Highly likely she's in that box right now. Let's see what we're... Oh, let me push it down here so we can see that a little better. So usually they'd be a little more... They're still kind of after me. But, uh... Go over here and straighten this box up just a little bit. I'm hoping that she's in there. But it's just going to take a minute to see it will ball up around her wherever she is. And if they come back out onto this tree, we know she was still left on the tree. Mm -hmm. And we'll just have to dump her off again. At the moment, she's, uh, I don't think she's on that limb because they're not bunching up there. She's most likely down into that box somewhere. And this is promising because they're kind of getting all up in this box crawling all around it. They're not bunching up on the tree anymore, which means that they've... The queen is not there. There was a little bunch in front of the box, and they've crawled and flown, and they're now getting into the box. As you can see, they're... Now, the queen may be up in that corner there, but... Uh... They're just all around the inside. The super has been on a high before, so it's gotten bee smell and bee stuff all over it. So they're, I'm sure they like that. The time before that this happened, I didn't have anything really ready for them. They sat on the tree for quite a while before I got them in there. And they'd probably, the scout bees had already found another place and they five six days later they just flew off and weren't happy but uh, as you can see the tree limb that they were on is devoid of bees now there's no bees out front there was a big pile of them a minute ago and they've all moved in just a few out there on the, at the doorway My next, I'm going to put this back on the tripod, and then I think I'm just going to slide the top on slowly and try to just kind of put them in there. Take. <laughs> 